hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today we'll be learning how to make the butterfly at the back of this design if you want to learn the old design i'm going to put the the link to that tutorial video in the description box and if you are here to subscribe to my youtube channel kindly do so thank you we'll be making the butterfly design butterfly design and this is the measurement so we're cutting 23 inches into two places 23 inches into two pieces into two places and we'll be cutting this four inches four inches so this is four inches and this is 23 inches into two places so the next thing we are going to do now is we are going to fold, double fold the edges to make it neat. Just like I'm doing, we are going to double fold both edges. We're going to double fold this as well to make it neat. And so after folding the edges, after folding the edges in for both pieces that were cut. So the next thing we are going to do, we are also going to sew this next part. So you bring the two together, you bring it together like this, and then I'm going to sew. I'm going to sew. I'm going to start from here. And use, I'm going to sew it to hold it firm to make this stay to make it one. So it's just like I'm doubling it. So I'm going to fold it into two like this, and then sew it round. I'm going to sew it on both sides. So I'm going to do it for both ends. I'm going to do it for both pieces. I'm going to do the same for here too. Make, I'm going to make sure that it's equal before sewing. So the next thing now, I'm done sew, sewing. So I, I'm done sewing that up, that part that was open. So it's now one. So the next thing now I'm going to do is I'm going to pleat. There's a way I'm going to pleat along that line I'm making diagonally now i'm going to do a plating so you can use your chalk to mark it so you can you can do it at either of both ends from from that side to this side whichever that is convenient for for you so just watch the pleats that i'm making I'm just going to make sure that it's the, from one end to the other end is meeting each other that you're on the right track so this is what i have this is the end result of that pleating so you're going to use your needle and thread to tack to hold it firmly so i'm going to do the tacking do the same for the other piece just watch closely Thank you. 
now I've attacked um, the first butterfly to the other part, the first part and the other part. Now I'm using the, that four inches that we cut earlier on. I folded it. That is why how I have this. So I'm using it to cover the rough parts. So I'm just trying to make my work neat. So I'm trying to cover some rough places there. That is why you use this so that the sewing parts will not show. So you just do it the way I'm doing and you tack and you tack it. So you come in and out. So I'm just using my hand to describe how you are going to tack. So that's basically the butterfly. As you can see, it has formed our butterfly. So we are done with our butterfly. So I'm basically just showing you here how you are going to attach the design to whatever design you can attach it to this Zara cap. Of course, the color is not matching, but I'm just using it to describe. So there you can also add embellishments. So you can add it to your Zara cap, you can add it to your um, headbands. So you can just be creative about it. Thank you for watching. Bye.